Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Wario Land 2 with MioXFu. And last time we drained the water from Wario's castle. Now we're going down to the Sela. And right away we get smashed with this guy. Wario went down to sit Wario went down to the cellar. He was looking for a soul to steal. He was in a what he was I can't even sing it. Never mind. He was in a bind because he was way behind. He was looking to make a deal. He came upon this Captain Syrup. Stealing his money and stealing it hot. Jumped up on his hickory stump and said, Girl, let me tell you what. I guess you didn't know it, but Captain Syrup's pretty hot. <laughs> Which is the funniest thing, I think. That Captain Syrup is as hot a character as she is. Because you'd think that Wario would be like, Oh my god, you're, you're, you're absolutely gorgeous, but no. All right, so there are going to be some. There are sometimes going to be the, these bats which drop instead of um, holding on to the weights when they drop them. Will actually drop them completely, and you can jump up on top of well the weights <laughs> in order to well jump up and get to higher places. It's sort of useful, but don't hold your breath. It's pretty much only going to get you gold. Alright, so I'm going to show you what yet a, yet another little thing in this game. Oh, come on. Alright, so sometimes there's going to be stairs that you can't always just get by jumping. Hold up and jump, and you can actually jump just a little farther. Now, you see this place? These are the most annoying things in the game. Because half the time, you're going to be wondering if you can get them right or not. That one was really easy, because we only have, like, two places where we would try to jump off. But there's going to be some really freaking annoying ones. And I think that's probably the most annoying part in the game. Those little gaps. Uh, otherwise, I love this game completely. Alright, so... I showed you guys just run past these guys. I'm going to show you another way of dealing with these bats. Basically, if you do a charge and then jump up into their into their gap, you'll actually hit them and they'll go away for a little while. Which is extremely convenient. Oh yeah, if you can actually hit them also, they'll just go away like that. Okay, we better be able to make this. Shoot. Okay, the, okay, I forgot about the... Holding up and jumping is your best friend in this game. I am dead serious. When you think you've screwed yourself over, hold up and jump. You may surprise yourself. Like, I just surprised myself. I thought I was screwed right there. Not only that we got, like, 50 coins, but 50 coins is a lot in this game. Alright, so I can't remember if we actually need to be small or not. Prob probably not. Ugh. Of course we don't need to be small. Alright, come on. Come on, Batty. Come on, Robin Williams. Okay, I'm gonna stop jumping. I'm Batty! <laughs> Alright. Jump and run. Jump. And run. Okay, there we go. We're through that fiasco. Yeah, we do. Okay. I was wondering there for a second because I'm like, don't we need to be flat to do this part? Yes, we do indeed. Because yet another mechanic. Um, That's the thing I love about this game. There's so many mechanics that are based off of just a few simple rules. You see how we're twice as wide when we're when we're flat? That means we can get over that gap right there. I don't think so. You know what we haven't gotten yet? That damn treasure. This is one of those parts that I'm talking to you that I that I was trying to tell you about. That will annoy the hell out of you. Because there's like five hundred different steps that you can jump off. And you can't remember which is which. And you're like, Ugh! Actually, that time it wasn't that bad because I was able to just get right in, but whatever. 
All right. Wow, 391 coins, really? Because that's a pretty short level. Anyway, we're going to go with 100, of course. What else would we do? And we've got the Monster Eye Man. He's actually one of the easiest to get, besides the, the Cake Baker guy, just because his eye stands out. Oh no, the easiest guy to get is actually the Marshmallow guy. And Wario gets a red dress. A red cocktail dress for some reason. And hey, whatever, Wario. I'm not I'm not judging you. You know what? Go go in your red cocktail dress to your potty and whatnot. <laughs> anyway, 734 coins now. Let's go for the play, of course. I can't remember if there's a cutscene coming up at the end of this or not. If there ever are, I'm just gonna say, do the same see you guys later, and then I'm gonna just show the cutscene afterwards with no commentary on it. So. I believe you are a six. This is probably gonna be our first wrong one, because... No! Okay, I lied. Well, uh, watch. I'm gonna get extre- no. I'm gonna get extremely lucky in this Let's Play and get every single one of them right. Now, however, now that I've said that, I'm gonna get every one of them wrong. And that's the second time I've showed, shown the save screen. Sorry about that. So, this has been Let's Play Wario Land 2 with Mio Uh Thank you for watching. Take it easy.